hi ladies so today i wanted to record this video i'm doing a little bit of a half talking half not talking uh in this video so i hope you enjoy it i am doing it on this look um this is actually my first actual video of me talking through it uh some parts again i forget to talk through it because this is actually my first official time doing a video talk through so bear with me <laughs> uh but this is a look that i will be showing you how to look uh how to look how to do and i hope you enjoy it so if you want to keep watching see so if you want to what <laughs> just keep watching so i just pinned my hair back because we're about to get this started ladies don't mind my hair it is not done i am going to do that at the end which reminds me i should take out my cleaner so i don't know what look i'm gonna do today for my hair but whatever it is is better than what i've been rocking these past days so I'm going in and I'm gonna start priming my face. I have been in love with the Urban Decay um, All Night Face Primer. Super, super different than everything else I've used. And I loved it so far, so I will keep you updated. But with my schedule, I am always working. Well, not right now, I guess. But my face is always coming up and I already, um. I had already put my face with my skincare, so this should be good. I should probably change my shirt after I did this part, but he's gonna go ahead anyways. Okay, so I prepped, put a little bit more on my nose because somehow my nose and my forehead are the most oiliest part, oiliest parts of my face. So I'm gonna go in as well with my Laura Mercier. My new one? Oh yeah, that's my new one. Oh, that's the same one. My new one with the Laura Mercier translucent powder before I apply my foundation. Um, I tried this, I want to say for the past two days and it has worked wonders. My makeup has not moved. It has been a great day, ladies. So I am going to stick with that. You know, I do notice that it makes my face a little dry. So if you're dry, don't do it. But if you're oily like me, like I've been, after I had goodies, but he said I have not been my normal skin self, so I am in the oily section of skin right now. So this has helped uh, immensely to keep my face not falling off, or at least not taking on anyone like my mask that I've been wearing, you know, to protect us and all of that. So. I feel like that is, is good. So I'm gonna go in with my beauty blender and my beauty blender is actually from me. I think it's makeup shack. I got it from my local um makeup store here in Palm Desert, Sound Stall House. So thank you for that. And I'm gonna go in with my new fave double wear um foundation stay in place makeup and it is in the shade 2n1 um honestly i bought this while we're in here in lockdown um because as you may know we're not allowed to go to stores so i did the whole <laughs> guess my shade or or whatever on their on their website and it worked out so it does look a little light when i first apply it but that's fine I, especially now that I haven't been really going out, I have been um, looking a little bit um, more ghostly. So I look a little bit more more light than usual. But so far, so good. And it works well. Um, I'm going to pour a little bit on my hand. Just set it in. So don't mind my eyelashes. I know. I do lashes for a living. Uh -huh. And um, so don't mind my lashes, please. After 
two kids. You need all the help you can get. Okay. So that looks okay. So I'm gonna do that, and then I'm gonna also do my contour. It's gonna be a little light contour, and I think. Crazy. I always say that, and then I end up doing a crazy contour. So I'm gonna go in and place my contour. I'm doing a cream contour for my jaw because my jaw is sexy right now. Quarantine snacks are really getting to me. So I think that's far. Thus far looks this fly looks that good. So I'm gonna go in and contour my little petite nose. I'm gonna go in and contour my nose. So I usually like to go in and kinda shadow it in. So that is as good as it's gonna get right now. <gasps> okay, I'll watch you guys girl. Go. Sorry. Okay, so you're gonna go in and I'm just gonna go in and blend all of this mess up, okay? Oh my god, I got something in my eye. Ow! Dang it, I pulled one of my lashes out, ladies. Okay, so and then I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna go in and blend this little freaky out because we looking scary right now. Shape tape, just because it makes my skin a little too light, like I look a little ghostly. But then once I blend everything in, I think the contour really helps to just like add some bonding into my face. With my translucent powder from Laura Mercier in the color translucent. And I'm gonna go in and just bake my face. So this is the only thing I really do bake. I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm okay. So I'm gonna go in and bake the face. I go overboard again, like I said. Oily, oily face makes you do oily control shenanigans. So I'm gonna go in and so this is how I'm gonna walk out and I'm good. I just get it though. Okay, so I'm baking. I'm gonna leave it on there for a little bit of a while. A little bit of a while. I'm gonna go. What should I do? What should I do? What should I do? Now I'm going in with Carly Bible's um, palette with Anastasia. I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna see what I'm gonna create because I really don't know what I'm gonna do with her. What, baby? Go get one. They're in the. They're in. The, oh yeah, got it. Yeah, just that more. That last snack and that's it. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna go in with this color right there. And I go in that color with in my crease. Oh. Palette with the color Bible. Okay, so I'm gonna go in and I'm just gonna blend, blend this color in. Nothing crazy, just blend it in. Blend it in very soft. Darker brown or black? No, brown. Brown it is. Brown it is. Okay. I'm gonna go in with that same Anastasia Beverly Hills by Carly Bible and the color Boy. 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 I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but it's spelled B O I E. Okay, so I went in with Mando, Mandela. An accident and it kind of went like over the brown and I really liked it so I'm gonna stay with it what I did I just went in I didn't go all the way into the back like to the end of my eye so I just did a little bit right there so it kind of gives it like a transition like it's like like pinkish purplish and then like blue navy and then browns so I liked it and it could be nice uh, 
I just finished up this eye. I'm going to go in and do the other eye. I put in the lashes, you know, and then I did add some details and I added this here and this here. So. so I am done with my eye makeup. I hope it looks good on camera because it looks good to me in person. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to go in and I'm going to do, I already brushed off my um setting powder and it looks okay i'm gonna go in and do my hair at the moment i don't know what i'm gonna do <laughs> i think i'm gonna do maybe like some straight down i don't know what i'm gonna do half up oh i have too much baby hairs look at ladies after i had these all my hair literally fell out all right here i'm pretty sure all my mommies can relate because a yo girl was bald and they're finally coming back i was scared i didn't want to do ponytails i didn't want to do anything so i may may not be dyeing my hair black let me know what you guys think i know it's a crazy idea i know your hair's already dark i've heard it your hair looks nice i've also heard like oh you should go blonde if you want to go blonde you're not gonna be able to do that but you know what I don't see myself going blonde. I did it when I was in high school going to college. And it was not my look. It was not my look. It didn't look good. So I did it. I went like a caramel. And then from a caramel, I was like, ooh, I think I go blonde. I think I do blonder. Or, and it just was not my thing. Okay, so I'm just doing waves. It's not going to be anything crazy. Because uh, your girl is not going nowhere. I'm going to add some hairspray, you know, just in case I... Want to go outside to my patio? So I'm doing my last pieces here. I'm just gonna be going in. fine lip liner in the color 1033 neutral yeah i don't it doesn't give me a specific name but i don't know morphe has a similar color to this one okay so i really like this color but i feel like i'm gonna tone it down a little bit with Maybe something a little lighter. Mm. A little just like that. Okay. And all of these smell like coffee. Like how delicious is that? How oh, delicious is that? Okay, I'm gonna go in with a little bit of a nude. Finish my lip combo. I'm going in and I'm gonna do something different with my hair because I can.
Okay. So I'm gonna go back and spray my hair back, and then I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna spray the fleas. We think as a lash tech, I would have more brushes. Where are my brushes? Over here. Okay. okay. look i went in and i actually was not happy with the curls they were a little boring um and i have nothing to do with my life since i'm stuck at home but so i went in and i did this uh it's a little messy so bear with me um but i like it it looks nice i'm gonna sit in my living room show it off to my man and that's the look so i hope you liked it i hope you enjoyed it and again this is my first actual video with me oh my lash is coming off with me um talking on it so i hope you don't get bored because i do forget to talk on parts of it so i will make sure that i skip through that but thank you again and i hope you enjoyed it thank you ladies